end bearing pile is one type of pile foundation it is a deep foundation which is a type of foundation that is constructed on soils that have lower bearing capacity here foundation is constructed deep until a strata of soil or rock with adequate bearing capacity to take the load coming from superstructure is obtained among several types of pile foundation an end bearing pile is a type of pile that transfer load through its end as shown in figure 1 below these piles are driven into soil and placed in the intermediate layer between the weak strata and the strong strata construction features of end bearing piles an end bearing pile proves the load carrying capacity based on the resistance of the hard soil over which the end of the pile is laid This strong strata on which an end bearing pile lie can either be dense sand, rock, or gravel. The end of an end bearing pile must be penetrated into the strong stratum at a depth equal to thrice the diameter of the pile. This calculated depth is proven to give maximum ultimate strength of the hard stratum that is laying under the end of the pile. A prefabricated pile or an auger pile can be used to construct an end bearing pile. The end bearing pile as shown in the arrangement initially pass through the loose soil and then is placed on a hard layer which behaves like a column. Hence, end bearing piles are generally designed similar to reinforced concrete column. Why do we need end bearing piles? End bearing piles are demanded for those buildings which are subjected to heavy concentrated loads. In areas of soil that are subjected to large fluctuations in the subsoil water level, an end bearing pile is a better choice. When there are canal or drainage lines near to the soil site or to the foundation, a end bearing pile is the best choice. End bearing pile is only adopted when there is a possibility to reach a hard strata after a soft strata of soil. Advantages of end bearing pile. End bearing pile are easily drilled through a hard or tough surface. It is suitable for deep installations and provide longer durability. End pile foundations can be pre-ordered and customized as per the requirements of load and the site conditions. It is best suitable for wetland construction and all sizes of land construction. End bearing pile construction reduces the overall construction time. It offers high resistance to failure due to buckling in the weak soil. Higher resistance to settlement compared to other types of piles is one of the another advantage of end bearing pile hence it is best suitable for the construction of multi storied buildings applications of end bearing piles it is best applied for the construction of water tanks and reservoirs for the construction of bridges that are subjected to varied heavy loads for the construction of high rise buildings and towers which have chances for larger settlement issues among all those features for end bearing piles it also possesses certain limitations end bearing piles can only be constructed by using heavy construction machineries and equipment when end bearing piles are inserted into the soil strata there are chances for the soil surrounding the piles to stick to the surface of the pile this would result in negative skin friction that will reduce the performance of a end bearing pile